When it comes to my spiritual journey, I am going to believe what's in my heart and the truth in my heart and soul and body over what's written in any book or what's spoken by any other person. And here's why. The Bible says in Romans that God has written his word on our hearts. And that is, I think, the truest statement in the Bible because the Bible wasn't written or present during Jesus's time. As a matter of fact, the Bible wasn't compiled together until hundreds of years after everybody who contributed to writing the Bible were dead. So when the Bible was compiled, men chose what letters and historical traditions that had been passed down got to go into the Bible. And you don't think human error came into play with them choosing what worked for them? So then they had to translate all of these different letters and documents that were in lots of different languages. And they had to try to understand the intent of that letter and author, which is hard. I can't write an email or a text message without people thinking I mean something different. Do you know how many different translations we have that no one knows which one's the right one? And unless you are, have a PhD in languages and history, you might have a better approach, but still you don't know. You weren't there. You weren't that person writing the letter and you don't know their intent. Understanding scripture is extremely complicated. It involves so many variables and people and intents, but understanding your heart that's a you issue. You get to solve that problem with you, maybe a therapist or two, but you get to decide. Just question everything because you can't have faith without doubt. Otherwise, it'd be fact.